Hey guys, it's Clay, and today I have a bit of a different product. It's not something like specifically new, like the Paradox Rift ETBs were, but it is a Crown Zenith uh, Pikachu VMAX Premium Collection, but this is the Black Friday exclusive. I was able to get it a little early. Some Walmart are stocking it early, and I made a little trip. Um, instead of five packs, this one comes with seven, which I think is a little more worth it because this thing was retailing for $30. Uh, with five packs but you know you get to two promos and you get this but this time you get a pin which is way better than just two promos and an oversized card which is just who does anything with their oversized cards let's be honest but seven packs and the black friday deal is this is 25 dollars. so if you have a walmart near you highly recommend checking this thing out next week for black friday because this thing is great i mean seven crown zenith packs i love crown zenith so let's get this thing open you can always tell that I don't pre-open anything because of all the noise I make. Just open stuff. So we get your usual unnecessarily complicated plastic wrap. We get the promos. Let me grab those out of there. My recycling guy's got to think I'm crazy because I'm just constantly throwing away giant chunks of plastic and like cardboard. All right, so let's get these seven packs at. Not bad. Not bad. This is almost an ETB. Like a classical ETB. Alright, let's get the pin. Ooh, this is a nice looking pin. It's double pieced. Sorry. Double pieced. Not bad. Not bad at all. We'll put it over yonder. Like if anyone can see that. Oh, it fell over. And we get the Pikachu VMAX jumbo card. It is a little textured. I am going to open my blinds a little bit. Let's get some sun in. Sorry, it's a bit groggy. It was a bit groggy this morning, and now I'm, now I'm up. All right, we got a Pikachu V and V Max. I do really like this V art, um, the promo art. I think it's a little better than the, the like set one, and the V Max. Eh, both are kind of eh. I know the Japanese one still goes for like a ton, like a killing. I think the American English version goes for like a hundred and some. Come on, stand up. Come on. Okay. All right, let's get into these packs. We'll put one pack to the back like we always do, and then we'll get into the opening. Hope you guys are doing well. The holiday season is coming up, and you know that just means shopping for everybody. Uh, V-Star markers. I do not miss those. Do not miss those. But I guess, do I miss energies either? Not really. Oh, I haven't opened Crown Zenith in a while. Anytime Pokemon Center has a sale, you get like special promo. I always, always, always just buy Crown Zenith stuff just because... I like it. Haven't had something cool in a while. Pokemon Catcher. No Galarian Gallery in this one, but we do get the Hollow Kyogre, which is not the greatest Hollow pattern in the world. But Sword and Shield Arrow. What are you gonna do? Okay. Recording without my flash on today because, like I have said before, oh my god, two V Star markers in a row. My lighting system is broken and I haven't gotten it fixed yet. I was going to say, is this the same pack? We've got, we're getting a lot of the same cards. Uh, okay. That one's a new one. Got, dude, what the heck? A Lipard Reverse. Hey, Hatterene V. I'm pretty sure I have it. Originally, I was planning on doing a master set of Crown Zenith. But, dude, some of those cards just aren't dropping in price. Like, I want them to from the Galarian Gallery. We are still searching for three out of the four gold cards. We have Giratina. We still need the other parts of the Origin Trio. And our good pal Arceus. And then we need the, the Mewtwo versus Charizard card, which is also like, come on. Give it to me. Energy Switch, Dusclops, Cricketot, Seal, Oddish, Corfish, Pokeball, Reverse Lycanroc. Lycanroc. <laughs> Alright, so far three packs in, we got a Hatterene V. But, like I said, this product seems great for like a non-super serious collector. You get a bunch of packs. I mean, there are very few products where you get seven packs for under like $40 nowadays. Um, so yeah, if you're trying to buy for some kids or whatever, highly recommend this. Seven packs, that's seven rips, plus you get a VMAX and a V. Um, especially for like the little kids, they just think that stuff is hype, you know what I mean? Just seeing a full art looking card. Plus, maybe you pull the Mewtwo out here and you get $80 or something. 
Alexio Simisir V Star. Okay. Okay. Or you get a Simisir V Star, you know? I know everyone's really in the hype of uh, 151, which, hey, listen, I'm asking for 151 for Christmas too, you know what I mean? I would love some of that. But Crown Zenith is still a hitter. You still get a good amount of packs, or you still get a good amount of cool cards. And, you know, it is a classic, especially if they played Gen 8 at all, or even Gen 7. A lot of the cards in here are, you know, reminiscent of those. Scyther again, Reverse Snow Runt, like it Rock. No Galarian Gallery cards yet. Also, something I will say, something I do a lot during the holiday season, is I will get, like, team bags, and I will fill them up with my bulk trading cards, whether it be sports, Pokemon, you know, Yu-Gi-Oh, Digimon, whatever. And just give them away. Like, I'll put them in, like, the little libraries. I'll take them to, like, little food, like, food drives. Toy drives. Highly, highly recommend. Because, let's face it, we all have bulk laying around. I, this is full of bulk. I'm probably going to end up giving it away. You know, you can trade it into, like, your LCS for, like, a booster box. If they do that kind of thing. But then you got to count it. you got to sort it. I'm just going to give it to the kids. Hey, we got a Dunsparce and an Entei Hollow. I don't think I have this one. Nice. Always good to get a card you don't have. Sorry about the lighting being so garbage. Hopefully I get a new light for Christmas. That'd be nice. That one's got good centering too. Nice. I don't think I'll be grading a Dunsparce, but... All right, so we got a V, a V Star, a uh, Galarian Gallery. What are we missing? Like a full art? Let's see if we can get that here. Dude, how mad would I have been if I had pulled the rare right there? Another Dude, th we've gotten like four of rare candies in seven packs. That's crazy. Carnivine, Tirubi, Young Goose, Emolga, Scyther, Starly, and we got a Dust Skull, and oh, one of my favorite Pokemon of all time, Luxray. Dude, I've gotten like six of this. Six Dust Skulls. That's so cool, though. So, you know, not the craziest opening in the world. Like, I've definitely pulled bigger hitters on this channel, you know what I mean? But, like, for $25, not the worst. Not the worst. You get seven sleeve worthy cards. You know, they're not the most popular Pokemon ever, but for like a little kid on Black Friday, this is sick. Highly, highly recommend. That's why I only grabbed one. I'll pro I might even go grab a couple of these for the toy drives that I do. You know what I mean? But that's going to do it for me, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. And considering giving, consider giving back this holiday season. It's a, it honestly makes collecting a little more worth it. That's going to do it for me, guys. Thank you so much, and I will talk to you all later. Peace.